Adelaide, you look mighty fine. Hello! Hey, you guys! Hello, all of you here and here and there and in the front of me too. <laughs> so spring is just around the corner and you are getting ready to host a beehive in your backyard or you're going to attend one of my awesome workshops. Oh, about this, uh, my next workshop will be held on the 2nd of September. See you there. But I receive on a regular basis those five common questions about backyard that you think. Question number one. I have a dog. Is it okay to have a beehive? But this is something I cannot predict. If it's going to happen, it's going to happen. If it's not going to happen, it's not going to happen. My dog got stung. Other people's dog and pets got stung. And once they get stung, they're not going to go and play with the bees anymore because it hurts them. But bees are not here to go and attack animals. They're just here to mind their own business. So, yeah, no, that's okay. Cat, rabbits dog, any type of pets is okay with bees. Question number two. I have kids, young kids, grandkids. Is it okay to have a beehive in my backyard? If the kids are well informed, everything should be fine. But, you know, accidents still happen. Is my backyard suitable for a beehive? This is a question I can't really respond without assessing your backyard first, but I can tell you something. If you really want a beehive in your backyard, you can make it work. Here are a few backyards that are actually hosting a beehive there. Question number four. I never got stung, so I don't know if I am allergic to bee stings. Well, my dear, better get yourself checked because when you have hundreds of bees around you and one of them sting you and you don't have an EpiPen on you, well, yeah. Question number five. I'm scared my neighbors will complain about my beehive. Well, look, um, honey goes a long way and you don't need to tell your neighbor that you have a beehive there. They're not going to find out unless you just put it in the middle of the yard where everyone can see it. So here was the five most common question that I get asked on a regular basis. I hope this helped. If you have any questions or comments, please comment down below. And yeah, see us.